Greetings, it's me, Firebee, and welcome back to Pokemon Platinum Enhanced. Last time we went and explored around Sunny Shore City, we persuaded the gym leader to go back to the gym, we got a, bit, a, little, a little bit puzzled by the gym puzzles, but we made it. And here we are, in front of the gym leader. Our levels are the same as before. Uh, I have taken a peek at the levels of the gym leader. They're pretty much what I expected. Uh, so it is... And I know it's possible to be... Might take a couple tries, though. Which I'll probably cut out, really. But, uh... With all of that said, let's get to it! Alright, Challenger. It's not often, but some trainers manage to come and challenge me. But they've all been boring battles. I didn't break a sweat beating them. Sigh. I'm Volkner, the gym leader. They say I'm the top gym leader in Sinnoh, but... Anyway, I guess we'd better get this done. I hope you're the trainer who'll make me remember how fun it is to battle. Alright, here we go. Final gym leader. Leads off with a Luxray. We'll lead with Linguini. Yes, this is kind of a bad matchup, but we have Dragon Rush if we manage to ever hit it. We don't, of course, because when has Linguini ever managed to hit something when it mattered? That's a trick question, by the way. Very much a trick question. Um... Let's see, we'll go with Soft Serve then. I'm pretty sure... The Luxray has all of the elemental fangs on it. Uh, I'll go for a nice punch here. Yeah, it has all of them. Because I know for a fact it has Thunder Fang. And here's Fire Fang after an Ice Fang. Yeah, and... Oh, that was a crit. I think we technically live that, otherwise... This is not a particularly great start. I will definitely say that. We'll try Giga Buddy. Uh, Rock Slide. I think there's probably only two things on my team that actually do outspeed it, and those are... Uh, well, I know that Linguini outspeeds it. And I, I would assume that I get it. You guys are tough. But we can match your toughness. Uh, I would assume that Starburst can also outspeed. I would hope so. That'd be a bit silly if a. What is this like? A. It's a. I don't even know. An electric quadrupedal animal. We'll go with that. Of course. Well, this gets it out of the way, and I... In my test run, they didn't use more than one of them, so they might only have the one. We can hope, at least. And Giga Putty holds out pretty well against their attacks. I'm gonna go for a Sludge Bomb, see if I can't get some passive damage going. Or not. That could happen, too. Let's just see if I am correct on my theory here. I am. I thought so. But, you know, had to be sure. Let's see if the AI will actually pull it back. Nope. That does a lot less than I would expect. Hmm. I 
after an Intimidate, we take that actually decently well. A lot better than I would expect, that is to say. Uh, let's see... Yeah, I'm gonna fly again. Nope. I didn't really want to, uh... I didn't want to miss the kill with by trying a quick attack that might not have taken it out. Because that would have been pretty bad. Okay. Next up is... An Electabuzz. Electabuzz are pretty fast. I'm gonna switch to... No ball. Because outside of any sort of fire move, I think No Ball can handle most things. Okay, Thunderbolt, I'm not too worried about that, I don't think. Yeah, not really. If only that did more. It's not quite taking things out in one shot. At least not anymore, it's not. It's still good damage, mind you. Uh, just... I mean, it's more damage than it's doing to me, approximately. Just a little bit more. Which, I mean, that's neat. Okay. I can get a heal off here, and it will go down to the hail, assuming that they don't heal. Let's see if they do. No. Okay. I guess Volkner only has the one. I'm not opposed to that being the case. Ooh, we got the pair of hats, though. That's not so good. But I suppose a 10% chance has to happen eventually. A Rotom. Okay. A Rotom fan. I don't think I have a problem with this. Air Slash could be a problem. It's a bigger problem than I thought. Alright. Alright, fine. I thought that we might be able to take that. I guess I'm wrong. Happens occasionally. I can bring out my own Rotom, though. The superior oven form. I don't have Shadow Ball, I don't think. So I'll have to go for an ominous wind here. And if I'm lucky, I'll get boost to everything. I doubt I'll be lucky though. Nope. And they of course have Shadow Ball. Yeah, and that takes us out in one shot. I'm not really all that surprised. But Rotom is down. Uh, and we have to go into Starburst. Then comes the Magnazone. Uh, I would totally take this on with this, but no. We have to go for a revive here on uh, Geek Putty, I believe. Is probably the better option. Zap Cannon? Oh. I mean, sure. But, uh, no. Alright, time to put a big dent into this. I kind of doubt it takes it out in one shot, but it'll do a big chunk of damage. Like that much. 
like, 92% of it or something. A Landsat berry? Landsat? I guess that's, um, considering that it said to get pumped, that must be for getting critical hits. That's silly. That's absurdly silly. Also, I just now noticed that this is level 58. I thought it was level 53 before. Guess I misread the number. We'll go for a rock smash. Yeah, this is definitely pretty much what I expected. A little bit on the high end, actually. Because I think my estimate went up to 57. So, I wasn't far off. Alright, so there's that. Two more to go. Electivire first. Electivire is a big threat. I would almost go so far as to say that Electivire is kind of the biggest threat. Like, yeah, it doesn't have the berry to get crits all the time. That would be a lot more effective in 6th gen. Um... What would do best against Electivire? Nobody, really. I think Gigaputty would just do best at chipping away at it. Because I am well aware that Electivire does get Flamethrower. Much like its counterpart, Magmortar, absolutely gets Thunderbolt. Those are things that are pretty difficult to forget when you get messed up by one before. Unfortunately, we don't have any ground-type moves. So, I'm gonna go for Rock Slides. That's annoying, but useless. Why would I be using special attacks against you anyway? When I can do half your health already. And we'll go for another one. Alright, that Thunderbolt will take me to 50-something? 40. Alright. That's fine. Just a sliver, but thankfully we have the power of hail. Thank goodness Soft Serve was with us. So technically that Soft Serve skill there. Alright, we're down in the red. But we leveled up. Giga Buddy is now level 50. Getting a lot of good stat gains. Alright, here we go. Magneton. This is it! My trump card! The thing that's like the second lowest leveled out of the entire team. I'm gonna spring for a hyper potion here. Because that's easier to work with. Okay, Spark shouldn't do much. It'll do, I think, about the same as Thunderbolt. A little less, okay. Sure. Only have three Rock Smashes left, though. Alright, there's the defense drop. If I get another one, then I can take it out in the three, I'm pretty sure. Because the next one will do something like twice that damage. Wait, let's heal first. Uh, movement milk. Go. I don't really want to try living on that. If I can at all help it. Because this Thunderbolt does a surprising amount of damage. And by surprising, I mean an unsurprising amount, really. Right, there goes the light screen. That was completely useless from the start. Shocking! I didn't see this coming! 
Ha! Electric funds. That may have been a bad plan. Okay. No, I'm pretty sure we can actually survive that still. It doesn't matter. We took it out. We took it out! We did it! Magneton goes down. We defeated Leader Volkner. You've got me beat. Your desire and the noble way your Pokemon battled for you. I even felt thrilled during our match. That was a very good battle. Lots of money. Only nine away. Hehehe. <laughs> Haha! <laughs> that was the most fun I've had in a battle since... I don't know when! It's also made me excited to know you and your team will keep battling to greater heights! This is your 8th gym badge! You've earned this! We got the Beacon Badge from Volkner! That Beacon Badge lets you use the Hidden Move Waterfall even when you're not in a battle! Waterfall happens to be key if you're going to the Pokemon League. As to where it is, I'll probably not tell you. Also, because you've collected all eight gym badges, any Pokemon, at any level, will now obey you without fail. I want you to take this too. TM57. I want to say that's Charge Beam or something, probably. What's inside that TM57 is the move Charge Beam! It made raise special attack if it lands, it's electrifying! Sure. I'm a little disappointed, though. You're the eighth gym leader. The final gym leader. And you're giving out a, what, 60 power move? Why not Thunderbolt? I mean, really. Anyway, do you have anything else to say? Your next step is the Pokémon League Challenge! It's time for you to cross the sea and win your way through the gauntlet that is Victory Road! Demonstrate to the Pokémon League your mastery of your team! Against you, even the Elite Four will be pushed to fend off your challenge! Nice! Also, I noticed that they've stopped calling them the Top Four, like they were doing earlier. I don't know whether that was just a whether this is just a consistency error or what, but it's a thing I've noticed. So that was the thing that we did on the actual first try. Not bad, if I do say so myself. I actually kind of didn't expect to get that on the first try, but... I'm not complaining that it happened. Oh, did you beat the gym leader? Well, of course you did. But you know what? You haven't made it in my mind yet! Do you know why? Because you and your Pokémon are capable of achieving so much more! But I am so proud of you! Eight Sinnoh badges! Way to go, kiddo! And our name is sitting... prettily on the statue. Not even Bacon is on this statue yet! Finally, we got one up on him. Finally. Let's go heal. That was, um... Yeah. Like, that that was a pretty difficult battle. Yeah, I could have made it easier and gone and ground up five levels or something, but I didn't want to. Mainly, I didn't want to go do the puzzle again, if I couldn't help it. Or if I could help it, rather. So let's go... Heal everybody up, and then we'll go talk to, uh, what's her name? Jasmine on the beach? And see what she has to say now, as opposed to barring our way like she did before. What do you have to say? I don't think I talked to you earlier. Do you want to hear me play my guitar, or do we battle? Uh, yes. Your spirit's vibes, you've got rock in your veins! I guess we battle. And they have a Delcaddy, a level 50 Delcaddy. Okay, cool. Maybe I should have dealt with them before going into the gym. Would have been some decent training, I suppose. I don't know if that crit had mattered at all. It might have. Slaking? 
Well, that's dangerous. There is almost never a case where slaking isn't dangerous. Except for when I get attack boost that I can easily get rid of the condition that comes along with it. Ah, uh, we missed. That's fine, because we get a free healing turn. Here, take this lava cookie and don't hit yourself in the face. That'd be terrific. They're loafing around as if they were the premium sort of bread. And we hit them with a plus two dragon rush. Which should do some pretty big damage. 100% of it, and the crit on top of it. There was no chance of that surviving. Linguini even gained a level from it. And wants to learn safeguard. No, no, I don't think so. You beat me, but I feel totally amped to jam harder! For trainers! Pokemon! For my girl, sweet kisses. That's the perfect world for this guitarist. Fair enough, guy. Okay, I'm going to... No, not that. Not that, I said. Item take. Item give. We're gonna swap around the items there. See if I can't get that to go quicker. Something like that. The touchscreen thingamajig there is kind of unwieldy with a mouse. Kind of. Alright, we'll do that. And now we'll go check out what Jasmine's up to. Down here on the beach. Hello. Oh, hey, it's bacon! What the... You went and got all eight gym badges of Sinnoh? Nah, oh, you... That's wicked, I envy you! The gym's right up there, the guy's amped to go battle some more if you want to try to one-up me again. But don't think you've won! Because I'm gonna be the toughest trainer ever, you watch me! Before I was dreaming, I just wanted to be like my dad. Now, things are different. I thought about what being a trainer involves. I thought about what Pokemon are. We're gonna get tougher one step at a time! I'm not gonna challenge you to a battle now, I hate to say it, but I know you're tougher than me. Finally. But not a whole lot tougher. Just a little. Our difference is... about a yard? Nah, not even an inch. What I'm trying to say is I will catch up to you in no time. If you don't hurry to the Pokemon League, I'll leave you in my wake. Hopefully not crash your wake. I'd rather not. Alright. Was that your friend? You know, I get that a lot. But yes. Seeing how you two got along made me happy somehow. It must be wonderful having a friend like that. That's a word you could use, sure. I'm sure there's other words, but we'll, let's go with that. Yes, wonderful. We'll go with wonderful. That'll work. A person that you can share anything and everything with. A person you can compete with without fighting. Um, it made me feel sort of warm seeing you two. It may seem odd, but I'd like you to have this as my thanks. It isn't much, but... We got HM07! Waterfall get... That hidden machine, it contains Waterfall. If you use it, you can get to the Pokémon League. Um, I, I I don't know how I should say this, but good luck. Okay, thank you. Alright. So next time... Let's make our way across the water, and go see how difficult Victory Road is in this generation slash hack slash whatever you want to call it. I want to see whether they've changed much. So far, a lot of this hasn't been changed, but it was 
made very early in 4th Gen's lifespan. So, there wasn't a whole lot of mapping things that could really be changed, I don't think. But I'll, I'll be interested to see what was changed in there. But I am rambling, as usual. So, that's what you have to look forward to, so keep an eye out for that coming soon. And until then, farewell.